We're back on Cavuto Coast to Coast. We get to figure out who Trump will pick for his uh, running mate now. And Joe Piscopo knows. I know he knows. And he's about to tell us. Good to see you, by the way. Hi, Colonel. Could be How your guy, you? Jersey guy. Could be Christie. That's yeah. a lot of talk now. I don't know. Think don't gonna... ever underestimate Chris Christie. Well, he's he... been about as popular as, I don't know, his poll numbers are way down in your this state. This is very interesting. This okay. is a, a political phenomenon, I think. All right. Is that you get Chris Christie with a 26% approval rating in New Jersey, lowest in the history. But, and now we got that, that gas tax situation. Well, Jersey, they've been debating it all week. Christie supports this, and the legislature, the Democrats, they support it. It's got stuck in the state Senate in New Jersey. They want to raise the gas tax by 23 cents. A gallon. Through. Which is a lot. The and the thing yeah. about New Jersey that people around the country may or may not know, it's known to have cheap gas, to be serious. Everybody goes and you're driving through New Jersey. Oh, let me fill up before I get out. It's, and known, you, you, it's known for off that. Off camera, you made a, a, a Jersey smells funny joke, which I just let go. I just let, I just let it go. But, but they have the refineries. <laughs> they, Joe, come on. They get the, you drive into New Jersey. I, I wrote the jokes before you were born. Do you then? smell yeah. the state or not when you yeah, drive in? And yeah, well, you do. There's that. But that, that <laughs> That's just one part. The flame that goes on the New Jersey Turnpike <laughs> over there. Yeah. By, uh, 14, but cheap gas, they were known but for. You so know, how does this affect Christie? The, well, the governor fought a valiant fight against the uh, Democrat Assembly, and now we're, we're on hold in the Senate in New Jersey about the uh, ra raising of the gas tax. But, but he's even, it, even he? with the low approval rating of Governor Christie, I'm going to tell you something. If and when Donald Trump gets in, and he, let's say Governor Christie is the Veep, if, okay. it, or he could be the transition chief, he will be the second most powerful guy in the country. I'm telling you, people are saying, oh, Christy this, Christy that. Don't, don't discount Chris Christie. What about people? Uh, okay, so people are hearing, and by the way, you know, there's a lot of talk about Newt Gingrich. I know uh, Trump's meeting with Governor Pence today, so I don't Scott know. Brown, yeah. uh, there's talk about, yeah, he's uh, on some people's short list. Yeah, I'm not yeah. sure whether he's in the five or six names that Trump you know says what he's looking at. Yeah. But Christie, why would Christie be a positive to a conservative who's watching the show now and says, no, nah, he's not. We don't like Christie. I mean, it's a guy who's hugging Obama, this yeah, and that. Yeah, he has yeah, a low yeah. approval in his own state. You Why know, is he a positive? Because he's very, very smart, you know, and he knows how to campaign. He's a great campaigner, and I don't know that there's a better debater than Chris Christie. I really don't. But what we're really hoping is that he becomes attorney general, because he will not meet you, with Bill Clinton. Well, anymore. he wouldn't be on the tarmac at your point. That would be, oh, man, I couldn't make that one up. I can't believe we're making that one up. Do you think Chris I, Christie would take, oh, a, a, what, the former president whose wife is being investigated by the FBI? Yeah, come on my plane. It's great. That really is. There's not a lot of people, even not a lot of, that I've heard, uh, a lot of Democrats defending that. I don't no, I know, I know, I know. Cause it, it may be saying, uh, they, what, when you ask someone who's a big defense, they try to, as Hillary Clinton did today, they try to change the subject, as you definitely did, I might, I might point out. About New Jersey? Right, you change, <laughs> <laughs> change the subject. <laughs> Nothing to do. That's professional. I, I don't know. You know what? It's all a Jersey thing, too, man. I got to be perfectly honest, what? as I always am on, on, on Neil's show and with you, Connell. It's like, we love Jersey. got to watch the back. We got, it's the family, a New Jersey family. So good, bad, or indifferent. You're loyal to your guy. You got to be loyal. So it's the governor of New Jersey the, as the vice president. I'm digging this, man. I like this. Two tough guys and Donald Trump and Chris Christie. He's better than it. Newt Gingrich. Huh? Well, I don't know. That's the whole thing. Neil, Newt comes on my show. And I'll tell oh, you, here this, you go. No, Come on. No, I, show yeah. some guts, Joe. Can I, can I, can I, no, I know. I know. It's like Newt Gingrich is what, probably the smartest political guy out there. I mean, he really is. Oh, but wow. I don't feel, I don't You're know hedging. that it's going to be, I'm not feeling, uh, I'm not feeling Newt. I'm not feeling Chris Christie. I think it's going to be, I wish Donald Trump would go with John Kasich. That would put, that would allay a lot of fears, but, and, and Kasich would take it in a second. I don't know if he would. If That's I offer you the vice presidency, you would leave that, that chair right now. You might be <laughs> God. Well, to be your vice president, absolutely. <laughs> that would be some ticket. Am I too tan? I looked uh, on, on Facebook, I look too tan. Oh, no, not at all. All the, brothers, all the brothers in the studio no, being not nice at all. to me. I said, you. Was, like, I said, hey, have I? Did you just look at yourself using your phone <laughs> while we're on camera? No, I just did. I just did because I, I posted it, but I looked too dark. I have to lighten it up a little bit. No, not Back at all. Back to the Jersey Shore. Back to the Jersey Shore. Well, you know, we're talking about Trump and everything else. Smelly area. Well, it is. That's what it is when you go into New Jersey. Don't raise the gas prices. It doesn't look like they're going to now, yeah, right? Now, uh, you know what? They, they postponed it. They were going to pass it. We're so overtaxed in New Jersey. Uh, the highest gas, the highest, we have the lowest gas prices. Now they're going to raise that. The highest property tax we have, inheritance tax, Plus it state tax. And it smells. Here you go again. <laughs> <laughs> I come here again. I don't even know what you predicted. I, did you predict Christie's going to be the running mate? You didn't, did you? You said it's going to be somebody else. I say attorney else. general. I say, I say, I say a tough attorney agent. general. Good to see you, Joe. Have a good, good fourth. God bless you. Always fun. Hey, <laughs> God bless America, man. That's right.